Hi, this is Josh from Lakeland Mills Incorporated. Today we will be assembling a Cedar Log A-frame, model number CF400. Or I will be going with you through the video today to give you some tips and tricks to hopefully get your A-frame assembled just that much faster. As you sort through the logs, you'll see that some of them may have cracks on them. That is part of the drying process of cedar. That's actually called checking, and it is a natural process and adds to the natural beauty of the cedar. After you're done sorting the pieces, you're going to take the half inch washer and put it through the six inch eye bolt. On your top rail, you will see a sticker that says this side up. You are actually going to have that sticker on the ground as you put the eye bolt in through the bottom. After you're done with that, you will put a washer and a nut on that eye bolt and tighten them down. Next, take your 8 inch bolt, 3 8 inch washer, thread that through the leg then through the top rail and then through the other leg and then you will secure that with another 3 8 inch washer and a 3 8 inch nut. You will want to do that to both sides of the swing. You can tighten those up a little bit but not too much as we will be moving those legs a little later on and you'll want those to move just a little bit. After you're done with the leg assembly, take a tape measure, put it on the top of the leg, and measure 32 inches down. This is where the leg brace goes to hold the legs together. Take your 3 inch hex head washer head screws and you can screw them through the brace if you want. And then I like to take and put it on the leg, take a hammer and just tap it gently to get it started. Very good. After that you can go right ahead and screw it in. And then repeat the process on the other side. In this step here, you're going to see why we needed the legs left a little bit loose and not tightened completely. Is because you're going to want to flex that leg just a little bit to get it to line up with the mark that you put there. You're going to want to repeat this process with your other set of legs. After that, you need to pick up one side of the swing so we can put our angle braces on. From the side of the top rail, measure 22 and a half inches over and make a mark. Then from the top of the leg, measure down 24 inches and make another mark. And this is where our angle brace goes. Once again, you can take a hammer to get the bolt started in, or if you have a drill or an impact drill as I do, then you can just go ahead and start screwing it in. Once you've put braces on both of the sides, you will pick the swing up, measure the same measurements again, and then put the angle braces on the other side. Once you're done assembling, now would be the perfect time to stain the swing. We recommend a good penetrating oil-based deck sealant. Or you can leave it to weather to a natural gray color. 
We hope that this video helped. Should you have any more questions, feel free to call our customer service support number at 1-800-427-5136. Now you can hang your swing from your A-frame and enjoy. Thank you so much for watching once again, and we hope you have a wonderful day.